You don't need to win all the time. I know. This Your is ego like, loves to divide the world into winners and losers. This is not true. If you don't, well, if you, what is the, that overused quote? If you win, you win. If you lose, you win. Or <laughs> if you lose, you learn something. Yeah, I don't, I don't something. lose. I either win or I learn. Oh, that's, I mean, I agree. Um, Sometimes you lose, though. Sometimes you really lose bad. <laughs> yeah. And you may not know the lesson yet. Yeah. You may lose something. Yep. I don't. Yeah. It could be I mean, whatever. You're going to lose at some point. It could be your job. It could be a relationship. It could be. Yeah. That's the thing. There are winners and losers. <laughs> and you have to be okay with being a loser, though. Like, you have to be okay with, like, trying and, like, not not pulling it off. Yeah. <laughs> I mean. Hey, sometimes you got to risk something to go to go for it. I mean, Yeah. That's what makes winning so good. But I think the whole point here is like there's a line where you, there's a little bit of risk. In the, yeah. Like, do you know what I mean? That's the thing. But it's confidence, that line between confidence and ego. Or that person. I'm thinking of someone in particular. This is not a game. You don't have to guess them. <laughs> I'm like, do you want to say the name? <laughs> you might know. But um, that person that they they – need they have this need you can tell they have this need to win every stupid argument uh, every yeah. factual point yeah but then yet you watch them and they never take any risks in life mm -hmm. like they're never actually out there doing mm -hmm. but they're critiquing mm -hmm. and they're making smart ass comments and they're like second guessing but they're never the one leading they're never the one putting their ass on the line mm -hmm. A lot of people on Facebook. Yeah, well, yeah. I mean, it's not really a big risk to no be shitty on Facebook. There's that's ego, in my opinion. You're gonna sit on Facebook and just bitch all day. Yeah. I'm like, what are you doing? I know. Well, that's that's my point. Like, it's, it's real easy to do that. Like, I understand holding like even elected officials accountable. Being one, you have a. A window to work in. Yeah. <laughs> you know, we can't right. change the world. Right. We, I mean, we are. Our, mm -hmm. We want to change the world, right? But it's like you have to work in your – the parameters that you're given, right? Um, but, yeah, some people just sit there and just complain about everything. Yeah. And not – I'm like, well, what are you doing? Like, be a community – be someone in the, involved in the community in some way. Yeah. Do something. And there's nothing wrong with, again, holding your – Yeah. Like, you know, holding people – accountable but um yeah mm -hmm. this is to me similar to people that quit the gym kind of because they blame us Ooh, let's get into it <laughs> let's get into Ooh, it shall we let's dig into this i can pull but just you know, this segment out and email it to people but you know i mean think about it is it like just just tell me why you're quitting <laughs> Do you know what I mean? You know, I think. Well, what is it? Like, it's, to me, it's not like, well, we're the best gym ever. I'm like, I don't give a shit. That's not it. Uh, yeah. I but, don't care. but what, what is that? There's a little thing in there that I'm just curious. That you, like, what are you talking about? That you want to know? Yeah, I want to know. You want to know why they're leaving? Yeah. You know that's, why. That's ego. You know why 90% of them are leaving. Oh, I know. Yes, I think it is a little ego. It is. It is. I think it's also a little. Um, the other two things it's the opposite it's like the fear of losing it's the fear of yeah it's you're like don't fuck my business up you know like some of that too some of that um but i also know that we could change for every person that left that quit there's been thousands of people if we changed everything that they said that was wrong incrementally it wouldn't be it wouldn't matter it wouldn't be a gym Right. I mean, I, yes. it would probably be yes. a machine that attached to your body and sucked the fat off and made you fit miraculously, <laughs> right? Yeah. And gave you massages and yes. fed you candy bars. I don't yes. know. Yes. It would be like this thing that wouldn't even be. So there's like a. a be a pill. Yeah. yeah, it would be a pill. Yeah, probably. 